Hey everyone, Mary here. We're back in the wonderful world of RimWorld Zombie Edition. And. Flugly. Flugly. Flugly gonna mine. They're gonna help. Fair enough. Fair enough. We still have the Horde of Hordes to deal with. Oh, we have an escape pod. Well, that one's not too bad. I think we turned this into four prisoners. And have Bushicus capture Latch. Well, yeah, capture Latch. Either going to be sold or join us. The next person that's buying people is going to get Mitch and Zeef. So I had the recommendation, and I really like the suggestion of coming down here. And throwing down some sexy wind turbines down here. And just rocking it out. The other one was... Chop these damn trees down... So that our zombies are not able to hide behind the trees and overwhelm us. I really like that suggestion. So let's go ahead and just be like... Pachow! Done. We'll get that chopped out. A little bit, a little bit laggy with all these zambries on here. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to solve the zambri problem. People aren't happy. I don't know why. You should be happy. Chat and recruit. I need one more person. I need power. Right. Yes. Um. I forgot how drastic our power situation was. And I've left all these guns on, inside on. God damn. Break down. Workbench. And yes, I did forget about these. Ooh, shiny. I could always fuel up the generators. I don't know why I forgot about those, but I remember now. So I guess that that's important, right? We didn't lose power, so I guess we can just cancel these. We're going to leave our guns on. I was asked, why am I leaving all these guns on? Zombies can pop up, just dig their way up in the middle of the night. In the middle of the night. And um, they can dig up anywhere where... I heard shots. They can dig up anywhere where there's dirt. So they could potentially dig up in the middle of our base here. And that would be less than desired. Cold snaps over. That's good. We're going to get plenty of wood here. Just gonna be nice. Get these things fueled up. Got our new farm area here. It's still super cold because I haven't turned those back on because they drained all the life out of our um, out of our batteries. So we have this grid here. What if I were to just be like wind turbine? Wind turbine. Wind turbine. Wind turbine. Wind turbine. Wind turbine. Wind turbine. And just be like Yeah, give it. I don't think I put one there but it wouldn't work really well until I trimmed this out so we could be like go ahead and build it and then mine that out that's a long-term project they'll get that done when they get that done not super duper worried about it um, you know they'll they'll start whenever they want to start we have the metal for all of it. The metal is not a problem. It's the uh, components that are going to be the issue. 
But we'll, we'll let them do what they're going to do here. And of course, this one is not going to do super well until they dig this out, which will take a long time. Because there's a lot of other jobs for them to do. Uh, blocked by sandstone. Maybe I should just have Fugly mine that out. I'm pissing Fugly off. Man, I wanted to build that one. Well, too bad, Fugly. You turned the other one on. So we got a nice little nice little power station built up. That should help. Yeah. I mean, at least helps some. Ooh. Um, nip. Should run up there, buddy. Don't get shot. Just see if we can excite him a little bit. There we go. Now go to bed. <laughs> ah, the beautiful sounds and dulcet tones of gunshots and zombie murder. What I've always wanted to hear from... A beautiful cavalcade of front guns. Oh god, it's so sexy. Look at them, they're just slowly creeping in and we're just mowing them down on the perimeter. It's gonna be bloody. It's gonna look like the Antietam battlefield. Oh man, that's crazy. I, I don't have anything to say. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's working exactly as expected. Um, I should do a cancel on these trees. Because Fugly going to get shot if somebody comes out. Anybody that goes out there to chop trees is going to get shot. Oh, man. Look at it go. It's crazy. Are our back guns even getting into it yet? Not yet. Hold on. We're gonna do something crazy. Run, Nip. Hold. <laughs> Look at it. It's beautiful. Nip, you can go. Those shots. Those beautiful, beautiful shots. Nip, come back. You're bait again. Get them all excited here. Ooh, we got a new person. Oh, no, nip, nip, nip. No, 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 no. I fucked it, I fucked it, I fucked it, I fucked it. Oh, nip, I'm sorry. Run. They clipped you, nip. No, go up that way. Oh, God, I fucked it. Four prisoners. Undrafted. Rest until healed. Release hold. I done bad, kids. I done real bad. I sent Nip out to get bit. Oh. Oh, me. Oh, me, oh, my. Oh, my, oh, me. Okay, we're good. Um, oh, crap. I almost forgot. We got something nice. You ready for this? Are you ready for this? We got a new recruit, but we also got... Um, an options menu with some mod settings. Look at this. I have to big, give a big shout out and thanks to Shogun for showing me this. 
Zombies will ta attack everybody. Where do zombies come from? Where there is soft ground. When do zombies appear? All the time. Uh, only doors uh, is, is what I'm going to do here. Zombie sense is normal. Zombies recover from in in injuries? Yes. Zombies will eat corpses and injured creatures? Yes. Um, we have a percentage chance of zombie colonists. Or of zombies becoming, um, oh man, look at all these multipliers. A 50% a chance of risk of infection. So there we go. Our zombies just became even deadlier and even wilder because they're going back to attacking animals. They're going to be more agitated. They're going to come more frequently. It's like the zombie apocalypse just kicked into high gear. Let's check Latch's stuff out. Work. Latch the smuggler. You can craft and tailor. Um, you're 6 out of 10. I really need Gmod to craft. Or to sew. Because crafting is still... He... Whoa! Crafting is an 11! Gmod can make components now. Yay. Everybody can craft again. All right. Well, now you're, you're one. You're one there. You're one there. You're one in my book. Uh, you can mine, construct. You cannot hunt. Uh, you can handle because you're really good at that. You can warden because you're good at that. Um, three, that's fine. That's what I wanted as a one. I could stay a three. All right, you're good to go. You do have a bed, right? Yeah, we got, we got a couple of beds. Where is your bed, Latch? Gmod Bushfugly? Nip Cody O'Neill. Well, your bed's there. Latch. Look at that, Latch. You got a bed. How is Nip doing? Nip got bit and just about died. But he's been treated, so he should be okay. Man, I need somebody to clean. And Nip is fully healed. That's great. Uh, that horde, though, Nip did us a great service getting that cleaned up. Thank you, Nip. Um, so, as a result, we now can have this. We can have this. We can cremate these remains. We can have these dead people foods. We can get that. We can get this. We're going to pick all this stuff up in the morning. I secretly like it when people with um, chain shotgun, when people with weapons die. Oh, wait, you guys are still up. We'll wait. We'll wait until morning. Nip, you say you're fully healed, but you're pretty injured, dude. Eh, well, you're happy, so what the hell do I care? <clears throat> Latch, what you doing? You're hauling that, huh? Why don't you equip that? Oh, you're a brawler. Never mind. Um... Kind of sucks that you joined us because you kind of need a gun for this. this little event that we're dealing with here. But okay. I don't know what Fugly was doing. 
We do have a little bit of a Zambi there. Not much of one. Holy shit, we got our wind farm up. That's nice. That's real nice. Now, if they were all connected and hooked up, it would be even better, right? We want to connect that up. And I'm just going to go nuts here. We don't need that one. That's just a little crazy. So we'll get the benefit of that. Uh, we'll let these early risers deal with that. Bush, I know you just got up, buddy. But you got some work to do. A little bit of people clearing to do. Well, used to be people. Okay. You're undrafted. Haul that. Gmod? Do what you do. Cody? Haul that. Well, haul those. O'Neill? Haul the medicine. Latch? Haul the gun. Nip? Haul the components. Fugly or asleep? So stay asleep. Okay, we just got hit with a bunch of plague people. <sighs> Shit. At least we got some free medicine. Um, we can have that. Cody, or er, uh, Bush is just like, I'm going to get that. All right, you're attempting to recruit. Fugly is still asleep. O'Neal, haul that. Fugly, haul that. O'Neal, hauling Twinkies, Latch, hauling a bolt action, Cody is cooking, so go ahead and haul that. And then we'll just let the bodies get picked up as they go. Um, Latch and Fugly are pretty unhappy because they're super sick. Um, we don't really have a hospital for them, but we're going to have to figure that out. Because the plague is serious. Fugly. Rest until healed. Who was it? Nip? Oh, man. Shit. Okay. Um, don't care. Gmod. Have you been treated already? You have. Oh, you can self-tend. I forgot about that. Self-tend. Um, Nip can't do doctor? Alright, Fugly. Nip. Rest till healed. And who's the other one? Latch. Self-tend. Break down a wind turbine. That's okay. Uh, Nip's going to lay down. We'll get Gmod. Already doctoring Nip. Look at Gmod go. Just anticipating our needs and getting them done. We're leaving the drugs out here. The steel knife we could give to uh, Latch. Latch would be pretty happy with that. What's wrong with you, Latch? What are you so pissed off about? Moderate amount of pain, feeling terrible, sick, wearing tattered apparel, observed corpse, awful bedroom. Shit, dude. I can't help you there. You're just unhappy with life. I can tell you, if you go berserk and start fucking with my life... I'll have you killed. Okay, so we're getting that all built out. It's a massive waste of resources. I kind of don't give a shit. Pretty happy with it. I think it's time we build a hospital over here, though. Um, 
So we're just going to go ahead and mine this out. We're going to mine that out. And then we're going to build walls here. Not there. And we're going to build actually you know what we really need to we need to we need to prepare this properly um i don't think i have hospital beds researched yet oh i do okay so we're going to go ahead and place these in a manner that would allow us to have as many as possible and that'll dictate how big our room is that is the wrong spot There we go. So this place isn't really big enough. We want it to be like this. Oops. So we gotta dig this out some more. Um, be -dum -be -dum -be -dum -dum -dum. So we want it like this, where I can have clusters. So this needs to go out to like here. I'll just mine this out like that. Like this. And that. That's going to be the extent of our hospital. But we can go ahead and shore that up for sure. And start having some wall put in here. And we don't want that wall there. I don't know why I did that, but I did. And then we'll just... Put in some doors to the hospital. There we go. There's our next long-term project. Hooray! And hospital beds, they get forbidden. Uh, we'll be making those in the future, but we're not going to uh, emphasize them right now. And hopefully nobody dies of the plague. Fugly needs treatment. His plague is still there. Gmod. Get up and tend to that guy. We don't want him dying in the middle of the night for no fucking reason. Okay. Gmod really needs a door. Latch needs treatment. He's got major plague. Alright, this door, or this bed is now medical. Latch, I'm going to need you to go ahead and rest until healed. I don't want you dying and becoming a zombie. So let's get him treated. Plague has wiped out my colonies before. It has never been pretty. It's not something I want to see again. God, what am I doing? Why am I putting all this metal down here? I don't know. Latch is really stressed out. His mood is just... He's depressive. That's wonderful. Is that... That's normal. It's not really tattered. Well, that's really good. Why don't you... Which tattered in your clothing? It's your pants. I don't have any pants for you, buddy. Unless I do. I don't. 
All right, well, you can be naked, or you can have some tattered pants, or some dead clothes. Those are your choices. Deal with it. It's the end of the goddamn world. You know, we try to give you as much happiness as we can, but not much we can do here. I mean, I gotta admit, the grid looks fucking cool, so I'm gonna leave it, but it's so damn wasteful. Oh, it's so wasteful. Fugly. I can't tell you to treat yourself. I can't. Somebody's giving up their bed, I think. Nip doesn't need it right now. Fugly, go lay down. Somebody come treat Fugly. That would be Gmod. Um, wind turbines down. That's okay. We got components, I think. Yeah. Cody's got it covered. Thank you, Cody. Um, prioritize hauling the herbal meds. Well, now, now, uh, the wind turbines are contributing to our power sources. And we're doing really well. I do want to build a big old battery room eventually. But... Yeah, you know, it's gonna be okay. Severe illness, Latch. Latch is now down and out. His plague has become extreme. Gmod is getting up to prioritize tending Latch the Smuggler. We are out of Glitter World Medicine. And Nip's just super pissed off. So Latch may die, and I believe Latch is the one who brought in the plague so if he dies he dies I just really hope that nobody goes with him ugly looking at you buddy plague major plague extreme severe pain he is about to break which means we won't be able to cure him if he breaks damn I really need some medicine. I thought they were sleeping on the stove. That's funny. Hey, Bush. Um. Cody? I don't understand. Who would do that? All right, you know what? We're going to we're going to build graves for these guys cuz nobody wants to cremate them right now. But I need to stop looking at those corpses cuz they're pissing everybody off. Okay. Bury him. Uh, oh, where'd he go? Did somebody burn him? I, I think we got him cleared. Oh, we took him to the freezer. No, we cleared him. Okay, whatever. That's fine. Uh, Latch has come back though. He's able to walk now. Developed an immunity. Developed an immunity. Come on. Still suffering. Oh, developed an immunity. Fantastic. We can start giving some beds back. Um, not a medical bed. And it is a bed for Latch. Fugly. You developed an immunity. That's what we needed. Your pain will subside hopefully soon. Your break risk has subsided. 
Um, there's not much we can do about it now. Critical alert, major breaker risk, fugly. Why don't you go ahead and get out of bed, dude? Um, I think Nip lost his bed? Yeah. So if if we can survive, Fugly, if we can survive with you doing your normal thing, tomorrow you'll be in a better mood because you won't have been trapped in a room. You'll be able to sleep with your spouse. That's my goal. That's my goal. We're out of metal, aren't we? Yes, we are. Hmm. Used all my metal on that. These bastards, there's no animals near them to attack. So there's not much I can do. It looks like that Mega Slurian got... No, no there's just a Muffalo Corpse. Never mind. I keep calling it a Mega Slurian. It's a sloth. Uh, anything over here that's left? The drugs and the silver. Nobody's awake to haul it. So we'll let it be. Let it be. Okay. Oh, there's a gun too. Um, in the oop, nips up. Haul that. Next person up gets to haul some money. Or floor, because we're going to put sterilized floor in, um, damn, that's a lot of silver, in our hospital. Oh, there's another bolt action there, too. Um, Gmod can't haul. O'Neill can haul that. Ooh, you know what? We need to give some joy to Latch's life there. Okay. Missing anything else? Doesn't look like it. At least anything that we're going to go for. Um, I would love to get down here and get to this metal. That metal. Not going to deal with those zombies though. We have to either buy the metal or find the metal. Who's having a break risk? Latch. Latch is just one depressive motherfucker, let me tell you. So we're gonna we gotta find a vein of metal and we're gonna do that by just mining out areas here. Mad animal. Um Not sure where the hell that was. It went away so quickly it died. Like instantly. Was it the rat? I think so. All right, well, we'll eat it. Well, there we go. You know, we've we've recovered from from plague. We've recovered from supply shortages. We've recovered from zombies. We're gonna go through here and cut down all these plants. And that is silver, so we'll have that mined out. And we're building our hospital. And everything else that comes along with it. And all this stuff. So that's good. Uh, we got... Our, our power grid has been beefed up quite a bit. We're going to make sure this is no longer suspended. Uh, sandstone blocks can be made. So we don't want that suspended anymore. We have the ability to make components now. Not too worried about that. We're going to clear all the brush out of here. Just a massive removal of items in order to better facilitate um, our defenses. Fugly's got that. How many components do we have left? 21. That's not great. Um, yeah, it's not great at all. We have a ton of money, though, or at least we should. 
<laughs> Holy crap. We got 2,623 silver. We got a ton of money. So we're good there. All right, we're going to wrap it up here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. If you have any comments, suggestions, over in the comment section below. And, of course, if you enjoyed this and you haven't subscribed, consider clicking that good old subscribe button on YouTube to let you know when I get fresh content out. All that being said, I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.